Good morning, early and bright from Boston. I'm Tony Schwery, and but I'm gonna be Gil Morgan today and give you an update about um, ESMO 2020 kidney cancer. Three abstract I wanna highlight. The first one is from the plenary presentation of Checkmate 90R. This was a phase three trial of the combination of cabozantinib 40 plus nivolumab versus sunitinib. The primary endpoint was progression-free survival and was met. Progression-free survival was doubled from 8.3 months with sunitinib to 16.6 months with cabonivo. At the same time, overall survival uh, endpoint was met with a decrease in the risk of death by 40%. Response rate were doubled. The safety overall, the combination was uh, tolerable uh, overall and the side effect manageable. Interesting enough, the health-related quality of life here favored the combination over sunitinib with statistical significance in two uh, questionnaire. Second, uh, with cabozantinib backbone, Dr. Powell presented uh, cabozantinib plus uh, atezolizumab, the PDL1 inhibitor in clear cell, renal cell cancer, two cohort, 40 milligram, 60 milligram response rate over 50% in both tumor shrinkage over 90%, toxicity manageable, the usual toxicities, very interesting translational work from Dr. Powell showing here the impact of CD8 and PDL1 on the combination. And um, contact three is open at ESO Cabo versus Cabo in prior IO. And finally, an abstract in non clear cell RCC with cabozantinib and atezolizumab from Dr. McGregor from the Dana Farber showing a response rate in these rare variant of 33%. Responses happening in all his, uh, histologies, papillary chromophobe, and uh, the toxicity manageable. I hope I was able to be a Gil Morgan for two minutes in Boston. Thank you.